This is Roger with Wheel Kinetics in Tucson, Arizona. It is Friday, June 24th at about uh, 11.45 in the morning. And I would say, well, I know it's at least 103 or 4. It's probably more like 105, 106. On our way to, I don't know, 110 or something. Anyway, no sissies or crybabies need apply. Um, this is a 2003 Chevy Suburban. It is a four-wheel drive. It is 5.3 liter. It is a LT. It's leather. Um, they stole the wheels. They stole the air suspension, which is the auto ride system. So we bought these wheels on Craigslist. Very high tread. And put them on the vehicle. There's some scratches. A couple of light scratches here. Um, and then we put uh, shocks, just regular shocks, uh, brand new shocks on them, which is why you will have the service monitor light or message on, uh, which you can just delete by hitting the uh, little pin in the cluster um, to make that go away. Um, auto ride was a nightmare anyway, still a nightmare, just like in uh, Lincoln's. Um, probably the worst thing you could ever buy in a car brand new is something with air suspension. Um, you know, if they don't, <laughs> if they don't get stolen like they did in this case, um, they break immediately, and they're fortunate. Once they're out of warranty, uh, you'll want to jump off a bridge. I mean, just the air pump in this thing is like eleven hundred dollars, and then the wide lines and the blah and the blah. So anyway, this is a normal vehicle now, with shocks. And if you want a new shock, you can go buy one for thirty-nine dollars or sixty-two dollars if you want a nice one, instead of. Uh, thousands <laughs> so that's why that happened so they basically oh and they stole the video system we put up we put a patch on the headliner where they stole the video uh, we were gonna just do a whole new headliner but we figured that maybe someone would want to do a video again and all you have to do is take that that little insert we put in there down and throw a video back in it'd be real easy I mean, this thing is just real the passenger side of this thing is beautiful it's got some rock chips on the hood, a couple light little scrapes on the uh, on the chrome bumper, but not really dense. The rear end of this thing looks fabulous. There's a tow package. There's your driver rear tire. There's uh, at least 200 pictures of this thing, uh, which are in HD um, in our gallery. Um, we try to make sure you know everything. Um, when we bought it, they had this white tape like thing over this door that it probably sat in the uh, yard for impound yard at the police department forever before they let it go and it kind of glued into this paint so when they, we ripped that off this came with it which is not nice this is not tape this is like clear coat that came off with paint in it you know obviously that could be fixed uh, Close it all. Um, unusual. They didn't steal your. Uh, that's your OnStar antenna, and that's your XM antenna. Almost always, those things are gone. Um, I don't know. Let's see. What else do we need to show? Let's show you under the hood real quick. It is running because I need some AC when I'm done. It is hot. Oh, these things. We're trying to figure out what they had on these things. This thing came from Colorado. Um, this was a Colorado theft recovery that they recovered, uh, I think it was in El Paso, and I bought it from an insurance company in El Paso. I think that these things had those little deer things on there that, you know, make that noise um, on them. I don't know, or who knows, maybe it was some sort of a light system, I don't know. Anyway, here's your factory fenders. Obviously, those are all factory. There's your smog sticker, 5.3 liter. Uh, they stole the plenum. That's the piece of plastic that says Vortex on the front of it. If you care, it's probably a $30 piece, maybe even $10 if you buy it on eBay. Um, core support looks great. There's a driver fender. And uh, you can hear it running right there. 
very quiet, nice smooth ride. Um, like I said, we've already taken care of the issue of uh, the auto ride, which is a nightmare in the beginning, so you're welcome. <laughs> we did that favor for you. Um, the seats, uh, the interior, very light wear, no tears in the seats anywhere. Very unusual to have a third seat in here also, which is right there. And this is what we had put in there. This is just like a, you could just run your finger around here or like a butter knife and it would just come down. That's where they stole the uh, video system. So if you wanted to deal with that, you could at any time. You wouldn't have to tear up the headliner. Um, probably save you some money at the uh, video shop or the specialty shop or wherever you're getting it done. Let me put my sign in the back here. Anyway, it's a great truck. I mean, this, this Suburban is killer. Um, it's got rear air. It's got the rear radio controls. There's the AC controls for the rear that the kids can't touch. I don't know why they went to the uh, new system where they have controls in the back, but my kids get uh, pretty much out of control immediately with that deal. So I'm glad to have them up front in the older one. You've got, uh, there's your pedal controls. You've got heated seats, which I'm not going to have on, so I'm going to make sure they're off right now. Uh, let's see. There's your VIN for the on the door. Um, it's a really nice shape, man. I, I can't even... I, I don't see many 03s that are in this good of shape. Uh, all right. Okay. Oh, much better. It was hot. Okay. Let's see. There's your odometer. 81820. There's your gauges been running for about three hours on blacktop and it's sitting right there. We give it some gas. The oil pressure is perfect. We give it some gas. There's that. There's the oil pressure going up. Is your overdrive off and on. Let me put it into neutral and we'll go to four low. I'll put it in drive. Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's the torque of four wheel drive. Definitely in four wheel drive and there's reverse. Drive. Yep. And in reverse. Yep. Let's see. Uh, let's go to four wheel high. I mean, auto four wheel drive. And into drive. And into reverse. Okay. Works perfectly. We also have a tilt wheel right there. Let's see, we have, let's see, radio. Noise. Yeah, that obviously works. CD. Um, you got the air, obviously. Turn the air down on the back. Turn that off so you can hear the air in the back. That's the air in the back. Okay, let me turn that down a little bit. Turn this back on before I expire. All right. There you go. 106. So, let's see. I gotta put my seatbelt on. There we go. Turn that down. And. All right, we got about a minute to go. Got to kind of hurry up here. Anyway, this thing runs and drives great. Sorry about the breeze in here, but it's freaking hot. So I am turning on the air conditioning full blast so I can recover from the <laughs> picture taking session I just went through. Um, this thing, I've driven a million Suburbans and uh, I've owned many personally. And this one runs and drives perfectly. Everything works. It's a really nice rig. Salvaged because it was stolen, not because it was wrecked. Definitely, definitely, definitely not wrecked. Um, please check it out. Um, it'll be a very fair price. It's four-wheel drive, and it's leather with a third seat and rear air. Good, uh, good deal for the family. Thank you.